It was rebuilt by the number one guy who builds flamethrowers in the U.S. There's only nine of these in the U.S. currently. Everything is authentic except for our nozzle up here. Which we have modified to take a propane torch rather than a road flare, which is what they used to use back in the day. So, as I mentioned, we use diesel as the fuel. Nitrogen is the propellant. So, diesel is super hard to light by itself. Nitrogen is used in fire extinguishers. So, super, super safe. Contrary to movies. If you shoot these, they don't blow up. They don't do anything scary. Um, but that being said, there is two ways you can kill yourself. You go straight up, let it cloud down over you. If you get too close to a ground or a berm and have a back blast onto you. So we're going to get out there. Pretty much going to point it straight out. A little bit a little bit of an upward angle. And when you hold it, you're going to hold it at a 45 degree angle. So instead of straight up, either 45 degree this way. 45 degree this way. That way diesel doesn't leak down into a propane tank. All right? Off the table for me. Oh, it's not that heavy. Everything feels snug. Give me a little jump. Make sure everything's nice and secure. Cool. All right. I'm going to have you grab this. And we're just going to walk right past the Modus here. Hey, Dom, real quick. Yeah. If this doesn't shake up, can I have your truck? Sure. 